Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. If I look weird, I'm sorry, but I am working with like second day hair and it's disgusting. So, decided to put a hat on, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, um, like the title says, I'm going to be doing a haul for you guys. Um, I went to Marshalls about two weeks ago and then I went to TJ Maxx a couple of days ago. So this is so the things that I'm going to show you are the things that I'm going to are the things that I bought and um, yeah I think I'm going to start off with Marshalls first. <laughs> okay, so I went into Marshalls like I said just to buy one specific thing and I came out with four things. Um, and the one thing that I wanted to buy was a sweater. And the reason why I wanted or I need a sweater is because um, I've been going to the gym a lot lately. I've been going like around three times a week and I don't have a sweater to wear over my shirt when I'm when I go to the gym. I mostly just wear my cardigans and I feel like I don't like doing that just because I'm like all sweaty and I like to keep my cardigans, you know, like nice and like free from like gym sweat and and stuff so i went into marshall's just to buy a sweater and i came out with or i didn't come out with like i bought this one and this is um by the brand head i've never heard of it i just really wanted a cheap sweater that will keep me warm and this does keep me warm um the other day it was around like 50 degrees outside and i only wore this with a shirt underneath and i went to the gym and it was fine um so yeah it has pockets here in like the sleeves and it also has a place where you can um put your thumb through but i don't use it um and this was around 20 bucks i think the original price was 40 so i bought this for 20 and i thought it was a great deal um yeah so i bought it for 20 and i really really like it and i've been wearing it every single time i go to the gym i probably should get more but i mean you know just wash it once a week i guess <laughs> okay and then i also bought brushes now i use these already this is the flawless concealer brush it just looks like this and it is so soft now if you buy your brushes from elf then you will know that um this line um well these makeup brushes line the ones that are with like black um handles these cost $2.99 each, like any single brush, and um, at Marshalls they run for like $2.30, which I think is a steal. And so I got the Flawless Concealer Brush. Um, I started contouring a little bit, but that's mostly what I do to contour. I don't, I didn't contour today, but um, I think it's just like the perfect um, brush to contour just because it's so nice and um, it's not too big. But I really, really like this, so I bought this one. And then I bought the e.l.f. Contour Brush. Now, I mostly use this just to like blend eyeshadows um, into the crease area. And once again, this is really soft. And this was also $2.30 out of the $2.99 that they sell on their website or at Target. Okay. And then I also needed makeup remover wipes. Now, I bought some because I really needed some and i bought the essential oils facial cleansing wipes and this these are detoxifying wipes they're they purify and replenish skin with aloe vitamin c ginseng um it says remove makeup dirt and oil and environmental toxins protects and restore now these come with 60 wipes and they were 3.99 the reason why i bought these honestly was because they were the ones that carried the most for only 3.99 I don't like them at all. Um, I don't think that they do anything. I feel like I have to use at least two or three in order to like actually remove my makeup. And I still feel like I have like so much makeup left on my face. And it just really annoys me. Honestly, I wish I could have bought like a different brand or like something more expensive with less um, wipes that can effectively take off my makeup. So I was really disappointed at that. And I mean, I can't really do anything about it. I just have to use it all up. So, yeah, that's what I bought at Marshalls, um, and moving on to TJ Maxx. So, what I bought at TJ Maxx is actually, um, I went into TJ Maxx um, not because I needed to buy anything. I only went to TJ Maxx because my friend wanted me to go with her, and so I went with her. And then, of course, you know, like, I love shopping, like I said. Um, 
I went into TJ Maxx with no purpose in buying anything, but I came out with buying a few things. I've actually been wanting this for a while and once I saw it at TJ Maxx, I was like, you know, my friend is here and she drove me and she has a car, so I'm not going to dread taking this back to my apartment. And so I got this kettlebell and it is an eight pound kettlebell and um, I feel like I'm going to get a lot of use out of it mostly because like I said, I do go to the gym at least three times a week and the days in which I don't go to the gym, I would like to start working out inside my apartment and I felt like I don't have any weights weights because you're back in New York City but once I saw this, I was like, I kind of have to get it and I got an 8 pound one because um, I'm mostly used to just using a 6 pound one or at least like a 5 pound one but I decided to, you know try for the eight pound one and hopefully i will get a lot of use out of this and um yeah this was actually 12.99 and i opted for the color like greenish because they did have a really nice pink one but i just felt like it wouldn't go with the room just because mo like my room is mostly like blue so yeah i bought this one and i'm really excited to start using it so the next thing that i bought i've actually also been really wanting this and i've been meaning to buy this but i haven't like gone shopping like that so i bought this dry brush from um tj maxx and yeah i just bought this one this one was like um the nicest one that i found because i felt like the other ones were either too soft of um of the like bristles and then the other ones that i did find were either too hard so i decided to go with this one and this it was only 4.99 at TJ Maxx. The next thing that I bought, um, it's actually something that I really liked. I didn't really expect to buy this and this is um, Fiber Love Chocolate Brownies and these are actually vegan. Um, so I was really happy about that because um, if you guys watched my previous video on like my PCOS, you guys will know that I can't um, eat any dairy products because it's really bad for me. So I've been like craving these like cookies and like brownies and stuff and I can't eat them because they're bad for me. Like I just can't eat it. Um, so when I found these at TJ Maxx, I was like, I just have to get it. So I got it and it comes with five bars and I've actually ate two already. So there's only three left in here, but I feel like I will save it for when I have class. Um, and I just want to munch on something and it's only 140 calories no hfcs i honestly don't know what that means no trans fat no hydrogenated hydrogenate hydrogenated i don't know <laughs> no gmos it's soy free and it's dairy free which i was really really happy about so it says 40 48 percent of your daily fiber and it's entirely natural and it says six grain and seeds and i really like this so yeah so this was actually only 5.99 so it was a bit pricey now thinking about it because it's only five bars and it's six dollars so it's like more than a dollar per bar but honestly if it means that i can satisfy my like chocolate craving um with something that I can eat and is good for me, then I will buy it. So I'm really happy with this that I got. And then the next thing that I got is actually something that I actually really needed. And this is the Tangle Tamer, the ultimate detangling hairbrush. And I got it in the zebra print because the other one, the, I didn't like the um, um, other prints. So um, this was $3.99 at TJ Maxx. And um, yeah, um, I'm, I really need a a new brush because my other one is just way too old and I feel like it's damaging my hair a lot um so I decided to go with this one because I've heard a lot about um tangle tamers and how you can use it on wet and dry hair so I'm really excited for this like I said it was only $3.99 so I was like I'll just buy it and then the other thing that I bought is something that I actually really need as well and it's a um what do you call it eyelash curler so i really needed a new eyelash curler because my other one is crap i i've had it for over a year already and it just doesn't work as well as it did before now they, they only had it in pink so i was like oh okay like i'm not gonna be too anal about like 
the color so I decided to get this one and this is by Danielle Creations and this was only $3.99 so I was really happy about that they um this retails for seven bucks which I mean it, it's not that bad either but it it, it was $3.99 so I was happy about that so yeah so this is pretty much all the things that I bought at Marshalls and TJ Maxx I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did please give it a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video don't forget to subscribe don't, don't forget to subscribe you can find me on Instagram and Twitter all at just 7 Christina and I will see you guys with a brand new video next week bye